What can I say, ladies and gentlemen? You like, you like the background? Apparently, my camera won't focus. There you go. You like the background? Yeah, I, I specialised it myself. Well, now er, I'm going to be recording every night just because of this lovely background. I mean, just look at that background. That is a top-notch background for everything. I mean, just just look at this. Yeah, you boys. Yeah, just look at that wardrobe. Yeah, you wish you had that wardrobe. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, we are playing Fred, Fred Bear's Fright. Because... We're in the Five Nights at Freddy's franchise right now. And don't worry, it's not a green screen because what happened really have to prove to you. Where's my green screen? As you can see, yeah. As you can see, you can actually see myself in this. So it's not fake. It's not green screened. So you can already see my my reflection in the back. But anyways, let's actually get into the game. Help Wanted, Fred Bear's Fright, Fun Fright uh, Inc. has created another great horror attraction now featuring real animatronics and props from old Fred Bear and Freddy's Diner. Locations, this location is even being inside of the original Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. I'm interested. <laughs> I've also heard that my name is not Mike Schmidt, but in fact something else. Hello and welcome to your new job at the spooky haunting place where you're in the trunk, swim around the shovel in suits, etc. Just kidding, those things are wired up and can't move around, like how they were fabled to back in the uh, day. Yeah, this is in right. fact, Just kidding. you're yes. sitting in the original Freddy Fazbear's Pizza right Just now. Kidding. Is that neat? The owners of this location sold the property to Fun Frights Incorporated while they're looking for a place to build their new attractions. So what a coincidence that the old pizza place was here. How perfect for an old creepy restaurant to be in this exact area. The land was very cheap too. I mean, the building was so messed up that they had to either destroy it or attempt to renovate it. Of course, they were going bankrupt. What up? So they decided to try selling it, leading to where you currently are. Speaking of the building being in poor condition, we've had to work in renovating parts of it already. Almost everything is complete, but the power died shortly after we started renovating. We have resorted to using a generator, so uh, make sure you don't run out of generator energy. If you do, <laughs> find Excuse a flashlight me. or something. It's looking pretty spooky in there, so good luck with that. Oh, What's man. With uh, oh yeah. I guess I minutes. have to read the safety packet to you. Uh, all right. Welcome to Frederick's Fright, the latest and greatest horror attraction featuring actual relics from the original diners. Where mysteries about the Fun, events were Freddy's tragic, Freddy. but not certain. Uh, in case of any sort of injury or harm inflicted by an animatronic occurs, we are not to be held responsible, as it is your own fault doing so. If the chance of a person has turned up missing or has a fatal event happened within our premises, the location of that event will be cleaned up after the attraction's running hours, blah blah blah. What a bunch of nonsense. I mean, I could understand injuries if someone was just plain old dumb with our equipment. But to die in our building? That's ridiculous. Our animatronics should be just fine. Uh, anyways, What's this, let's the Matrix? finish up on how you have to work <laughs> in place. So to your left, you have a big old door thing from the old Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. Yeah, we got that from the first the guests while they're playing the flashlight game next to your office. It makes a cool transition from when they leave the game and enter the office. And finally, to your right, you have a false vent that you can shut once the guests have exited. We don't want them coming back through, or something like that? I don't know. Alright, I'll leave you to it now. See you on the flip side. Far out, dude! What, what happened to that fun guy? He was like, oh yeah, dude. Uh, I haven't learned to play Five Nights at Freddy's 3 on the channel, but I have played it myself when I was about six. I think it was six. Yeah, I think it was six. I think. Yeah, I think I was. Anyways, here we are. Well, we're just here on the night shift. Read a bunch of Matrix stuff. The frick was that? You can't actually see out the damn, damn door. Uh, okay. Whoa, okay, so we already got like a designer Chica and a marionette. 
That's nice. I don't like this guy. This guy's uglier than these two. Let the action begin. Where are you at, boy? Or go? I don't know what gender you are. Where are you? Where are you? I can't see her. How you doing? Oh, crap. Alright. Okay. We already are on there. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Alright, get off the damn camera. Oh, freaking hell. Alright. Okay. So we got freaking Bon Bon over there. To be fair, I really don't like this already. Hey, you just... Please tell me you just returned back to the stage or something. Also, you're gonna be like pretty fast bear, huh? What's up? Wanna come and mess with me, Hans? Come on then. Yeah, that jaw's gonna be broken in about three or five seconds. Oh! Freak! Oh, come on! This is not fair. Nothing. Oh my god. <laughs> well, that was interesting. I never knew that was going to happen. I'm trying to think. Maybe if I just close this door. Hello and welcome to your new job at the spooky haunty place where animatronics Maybe. were around the shovel and suits, etc. Just kidding. Those things are wired up and kicked the ground, like how they were fabled to back in the day. In fact, you're sitting in the original Freddy Fazbear's Pizza right now. Is that neat? The owners of this location sold the property to Fun Frights Incorporated while they're looking for a place to build their new attractions. So what a coincidence that the old pizza place was here. How perfect for an old creepy Sounds restaurant like, to be in this exact area. The land was very cheap too. I mean, the building was so yeah, messed up that, that they had to either destroy it or attempt to renovate it. <clears throat> of course, they were going bankrupt, so they decided to try selling it, leading to where you currently are. Speaking of the building being in poor condition, we've had to work in renovating parts of it already. Come here, butter. Almost everything is complete, here, but the butter. power died shortly after we started renovating. We have resorted to using a generator, so uh, make sure you don't run out of generator energy. If you do. Just try to find a flashlight or something. It's looking pretty oh, spooky in there, so good luck with that. I'm gonna shut oh, that right door. Uh, oh, Drop. yeah. I guess I have to read the safety oh, package similar. to you. Uh, Alright. Welcome to Frickers oh, Sprite, the latest and greatest horror attraction featuring actual relics from the original diners, where mysteries about the events were tragic but not certain. I wanna see if in I can spot that with this door closed. I, I just wanna have a little bit. By the animatronic occurs, we are not to be held responsible as it is your own fault doing so. If the chance of a person has turned up missing or has a fatal event happened within our premises, the location of that event will be cleaned up after the attraction's running hours, blah, blah, blah. What a bunch of nonsense. I mean, I could understand injuries of what someone a bunch just of clean nonsense. up done with our equipment. But to die in our building? That's ridiculous. Our animatronics should be just fine. Uh, anyways, let's finish up on how you have to work the place. So to your left, you have a big old door thing from the old Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. It's used to close off guests while they're playing the flashlight game next to I your can office. Always hear them, that it makes a so. cool transition from when they leave the game and enter the office. And finally, to your right, you have a false vent that you can shut once the guests have exited. I we don't want them coming just back through. Something like that. Okay, I don't I can know. All right, the I'll night. leave you to it now. See you on the flip side. See you on the flip side, bro. Right, uh, I want to see if I can survive with this door closed. I'm just gonna hear for this, this. 
I guess. They moved yet? Nah, we're actually not going to open the door. Just a little bit. We're going to wait until it hits like 3 a.m. or something. This kind of looks like the bite of 87. I don't know. I'm just kind of looking forward to this dude jump scaring me again. Alright, I'm just gonna wait until it's like 3 a.m. and I wanna close out this one door. It's just a matter of time. Up! Oh. Matter of time, not matter of time. Now it's gonna hit. So, uh, how are you guys doing today? Or in the night? You guys doing good? Good. I'll be having a good day. Yep. Of course. Uh, sure. This guy's vanished. Not sure where. Alright, we're not going to waste any more power. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a nice little drink. strategy to this game. I told you guys. Sweet freedom! Ya boy! Hey. Press S to sing. I'm pressing S. I'm singing! Maybe a little too fast. Show O one is over. Schnazzy. Right, well I'm just gonna wait until like two AM and then we're gonna close both doors. Simplest strategy. No, not both doors, I one door. Alright, what's got for me, bro? Hello, oh hey. Welcome back to Fred Bruce Fred. I'm hoping that you're starting to get comfortable now. Okay, so I have some pretty good news right now. We have been working on the animatronic programming and they seem to be working a bit now. That prototype
type of animatronic ender skeleton is starting to be able to turn around and stuff now. Along with a few others having some movement. You mean now. this guy? I think that's yeah, this pretty guy cool. Moved first you guy. think so? Uh, okay. Time for a bit more info on things you can operate in your office. So, do you see that pullable lever on the office's ceiling? Yeah. You can use that to fill up your spray bottle in the morning when you have to go clean up the animatronics. Make sure to only clean the joints, as getting liquids on the animatronic parts themselves could damage the electronics inside, it's gotta make or sure you this guy mess up move. the coating. I know it's silly to have that lever right there in it's seven seconds, like but ten I guess that doesn't really five. matter. Okay, you have a camera system to look at on your laptop, which also is a half-restored thing from Freddy Fazbear's. You can check the rooms as people go through the attraction, and make sure that no one goes into the attic or somewhere they shouldn't be. Also keep an eye on prototype. Oh. It seems to move a bit at random time, so just look at it from time to time to make sure it Shut doesn't up. fall over. Then there's an animatronic moveset operator to the right of your office, which is still a work Wait. in progress. That should eventually make an animatronic no. something spooky when you enter a certain code. All this stuff should be complete in nearly a week. So if something doesn't work correctly, or you see some boxes laying around, those things will be worked on. Programming the animatronics and working on the building functions will be our top priority over the next couple of days. Alright, this guy I'll talks be for straight two out. hours. Good night. Yeah, a hour and a half. To where? To where? To where, please? The freak was that? Right now, I just gotta keep it on the store. I don't even have to open up my camera, because if I do, then the guy's gonna show up and I'm gonna pull that lever and then I'm just gonna boom! I'm gonna BOOM! I'm gonna wet the guy. That's how they rock. Come for the door. How about you come for that door, buddy? Come for the door, buddy! Still don't hear anything. Still don't hear anything. Huh? Still don't hear anything. Come on, buddy. We're your best friends. What are you talking about? I think I have literally applied for the best strategy of all time. Literally just waiting here until 5 a.m. Now I'm trying to get me. Come on, buddy. Getting on top of things. Getting nice. Getting tasty. Getting fresh. Fresh delicious. Oh yeah. I've got this. <laughs> now I just gotta wait for the inevitable. Okay, if anybody's actually gonna come through the door, just please take your time. <laughs> take your time. I mean, as chubby as you lot are, it does take a little bit of time just to get through a... So, uh, freak out! Holy shit, the ones, bruh! Who's at the freaking door? Didn't hit nothing, so I'm good. Oh, it's 4am, but I'm gonna make it. I'm literally gonna make it, guys. There's no doubt about it. So let's just do like a whole video of me like literally surviving the whole night. That like should be a good video, actually. Well, I'm gonna win anyway. Look at my power and look at my aim. I've got an advantage, boys. I don't know what this keypad's for. Probably gonna someone's gonna shout out the numbers and I'm gonna type it into this typey Cody piece of crap. Probably. Well, I, I don't know. But it kind of looks like it. <laughs> I'm just seeing what it looks. What does this freaking mean? Hydra look. Hi. Hydra. Hydra 
Hydrolysis. Hydrolysis? Still waiting for somebody to get their chubby butt in this chubby vent. Climb through this freaking vent. Right as I said that! Right as I said it! Right as I freaking said that, guys. Right as I said it. Oh, I wish somebody would come out this vent. And this one just gets in the vent. Seems easier than any other FNAF game I've ever played in my life. <laughs> I mean, right <sighs> to dance. That was interesting. What? Hello? Ah, uh, okay. So the programming of the animatronics is getting closer to being ready for the track. The it's, it's not perfect, but we're getting there. Uh, so Cam 2A should be getting worked on tomorrow along with the animatronic AI operator. Heck, I may even come in tomorrow night to start working on it myself. It's pretty exciting seeing this place coming together so nicely. Yeah, the generator also soon. should be getting replaced. Yeah, it's, it's really coming together. Like really, I mean, it's totally so operating the facility place. should become much easier. Look at you, right? What the? Uh, anyways, I wanted to go over some explanations of things we've done within the facility, just in case you weren't already aware. So, we actually had to find those spring fretters who said damn a trunk set some old diner off in the middle of nowhere. Right in? in fact, they're already the? pretty messed up looking when we found them. Apparently, some other company started fixing them up or some type of attraction, but it got burned up or something. The person who tried fixing them up did a lousy job on them anyways. Oh well, at least what we got the, the hand freak? puppets. They weren't, they aren't really scared at all, but they do fit in with the attraction. So far we've set up the facility to go oh. in a path starting at the first location, then ending at the last Freddy Fazbear's. I've got nothing else to really say, except that you must make sure that our animatronics don't malfunction while you're watching. I freaking trust this. Okay, I'll quit bothering you. What the freak? Good luck. What the freak is going on? What the freak? Okay. I get jump scared now. I don't accept it. <laughs> I mean, this guy was talking, and I, the audio was a little too loud. And the audio for that was not. <laughs> Shut the frick. Why are you all going for the vents? Three, one, seven, eight, three. Does that mean I did it correctly? <laughs> Sorry if I jumped again. <laughs> Jesus. I'm gonna close the damn door and now I'm gonna do it. Even if it wastes me power. Jinx myself. 
I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Unless that phone call comes back. the freak away that's what I want to hear it was good knowing you guys but I'm gonna die <laughs> So it takes about four. It takes about four seconds. I knew I heard it. It takes about four seconds for the power to go down. That means I'm freaking dead. <laughs> I'm waiting for that phone call to come back. Tell me out the numbers. Listen, you all think I'm afraid? What the freak you talking about? I ain't afraid. I ain't never afraid. Afraidness comes from the mind. Of course. Seven. One. Five. Three. One. She's like, then you're good. Okay, please don't tell me there was a guy in the vent. I'm starting to get sweaty. Please don't tell me there's a guy in the vent. There wasn't, but now there is. Okay, I'm dead. Look at the power. Look at my AM. I am. I am dead. So dead. Well, it was nice knowing you folks, but I think I'm going to die. So you know what? I'm gonna open this freaking door. Let everyone come in. Come on in! Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Lucky chances, thank you God. Mwah. Oh my God. That was lucky. Ugh, get that, ugh, get that stuff. Come on, do they like it? Whoa! Oh my gosh. Show all three is now over. Can't stand it. Can't stand to you all heard of that song. They don't lie to me. Oh, I love that song. It's my favourite song. Can't Stand It by James Bond. It's my favourite song by far. Hey, uh, I was on my way over to see you. Yeah, I'm gonna mute you real quick, because I need to concentrate. But I'm gonna survive this whole game. I need to concentrate. Where the frick is he gone already? Yes, change it up. Can't stand it. Can't stand Okay, I can't stand your love for me. In my bed. The freak kind of bull crap. My freaking god. was that noise? Who the frick are you? Who? 
in the everlasting. That's what you freaking thought. You thought wrong, right, big boy. Is this guy? Go ahead. I dare you. Get in that vent. I dare you. Cause I got a ten. I got a ten-ton steel vault going down. Get your face. But really, you want it? He keeps on making a sound every single time he leaves. Stop doing that. Just gonna have to keep checking on him. Serving battery. Of course you'd be over there. I mean where we? don't freaking move like freaking Voldemort. I really do want to know what the frick you are, so I can defeat you. Don't tell me back there again. Oh frick. for the love of Jim and Lucy's. Your nasty booty over here. Did I get a back? It's already done. Bring a ten ton steel wear butt over here, you're gonna die. What the absolute frick? He wasn't there. Means he's not gonna be beat. Where is it? He went for the left door twice. What the freak was this guy thinking? Oh, is he? St is he still not going for the damn left door? Damn man, he's going for that left. He's going for that left door like it's a freaking cheesecake. What the freak is your obsession with that left door? What is your obsession with the door? Oh, you frick up. This... That was... That was quick! Did you guys see that? That was quick. I might be able to make it, but I also might not. Oh, you frick. Idiot! It's closed, boy. I'm gonna die. It's immediate death. Oh no! I might have a chance. I might have a chance if the douchebag doesn't go for the right door. I just hope you not see his glowing white eyes in the darkness, waiting for me. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Do you get me, guys? Like, do, do you get me? I'm so. I'm so freaking dead. <laughs> guys, this is the end. Guys, really? This is the end. Once it gets like two percent power, I'm gonna just open the doors. Wait, what? What 
the frick just happened? What the frick just happened? What the frick is this? Wait, no. Wait, no. Wait, no. Oh, oh, hey. Hey, well, day four. I knew you could do it. Uh, hey, listen. Uh, I may not be around to send you a message tomorrow. No it's, way. It's been a bad night here. It's phone guy. Me. Um, I I'm kind of glad that I recorded my messages for you. Uh, when I did. Uh, hey, do me a favor. Uh, maybe sometime uh, you could check inside those suits uh, in the back room. Uh, I'm going to try to hold out until someone what checks. Maybe it won't be so bad. Yeah, I, I, I always wondered what was in all those empty heads back there. You know. Oh no. So what's in the extras, my baby? Boy. Alright, so we got dismantled Fredbear. Dismantled Spring Bonnie. Scrap Is it is the other guy? His name's Fright? Jesus. He's ugly. Hand puppets. Wait, those are animatronics? I didn't realise. Scrap Fredbear. Isn't Scrap Fredbear the one that What's it? What's it? Isn't Scrap? Ah, uh, the one, the one, the one, the one, the one, the one. Isn't he the one that uh, screams out the numbers for you? Cause I have a feeling that's what he does. But hey, one star. We're probably gonna do like a second episode because hey, we got life worth it. But anyways, guys, I will actually leave the episode here. Thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy, why not subscribe and please subscribe. I am lonely as hell and I need subscribers quick <laughs> all right but you know we're trying to beat 50 right now and by the looks of it we've, we've got 52 so let's try and hit like 55 or something halfway at least but if you guys would subscribe I would highly appreciate it I uh, don't have to watch all my videos but hey just subscribe all right look at the bright side you know if don't turn on bell notifications but hey just subscribe and I'll of course see you in the next video goodbye